It's a big anniversary for a movie that means so much to our region's coal industry. Eyewitness News reporter Kevin Hayes has more about the 50th anniversary of the Molly Maguires, which honors our mining heritage. Is there a miner in your family? The Molly Maguires released this month back in 1970, a tribute to the struggle of northeastern Pennsylvania miners against oppressive conditions. You got to keep your heritage. Got to remember where you came from, you know. Friday night, a special screening at the FM Kirby Center put the story on the big screen where it had premiered 50 years earlier when the theater was called the Paramount. To see it here on the big screen, it's the major, major thing. It really is. Some remember seeing the movie when it first premiered. Others remember the work of people in our area to bring the film to life. And I know there's a lot of people that locally that were participating in this movie as extras, so that's cool to see that too, to see like people who have passed on to actually come back to life again in this movie. The movie may be based on a novel, but it depicts real struggles of some of the backbone of the region. The importance of the mining industry was the importance of the country. The uh, Industrial Revolution would not have happened without anthracite mining. Many can trace their family tree to miners in the area, and some are keeping their memory alive in different ways. My son actually goes to Penn State University, and he's actually studying mine exploration right now, too. It's passing on from one generation to the next. Here in Wilkesbury and throughout northeastern Pennsylvania, there's excitement that the movie, the culture, and this theater behind me have all stood the test of time. At the FM Kirby Center in Wilkesbury, Kevin Hayes, Eyewitness News. Tonight kicked off a series of cinema classics each month this year that will make their way back to the silver screen at the Kirby in downtown Wilkesbury.